1. Samsung 1 terabyte. If there's one company that tends to rule in the SSD market space, it's Samsung. The 850 EVO was a long-time favorite, which remains viable even today, but the 860 EVO line has largely displaced it. Samsung currently trades blows with Crucial for our top pick, depending on capacity and current prices, but both are excellent drives with proven reliability and performance. The 1 terabyte 860 EVO hits the sweet spot for price and performance, but the higher capacity models are also worth a look, especially as they're relatively cheap and dropping in price as the months go by. These are great SATA drives, so you're unlikely to have compatibility issues here. The newer 970 Samsung drives are great, if you're looking for a NVM alternative, but they currently cost about 30 to 50 percent more. So, 50% more, so you really should consider whether you want to spend that money. For cost versus performance, this 860 EVO 1 terabyte SATA really hits the sweet spot, and it's often reduced via Amazon or New Egg, too. WD50 Western Digital has long been recognized for its role in the volatile spinning hard drive market a space often ridiculed for the, the fundamental unreliability of the technology it bolsters. If we weren't clear enough already, the WD Black SN750 is proof the company can find success outside the rickety data storage hardware of yesteryear. Though it's not without its faults, this M.2 form factor NVM drive is a speed demon, made faster by a gaming mode you can toggle on or off in the company's integrated SSD dashboard software. Of course, kicking it into overdrive also means cranking up the heat which, according to Western Digital, necessitates the use of a thermal heatsink. Sold separately, the heatsink model is optional and sold at a premium, but the company claims its passive cooling features aid with ushering in optimal levels of performance. Levels of performance. 3. Crucial Terabyte The ideal SSD for a gaming PC strikes a perfect price-slash-performance-slash-reliability balance, which is more difficult than it sounds. Crucial's MX500 is one of the few drives that really has no weak points, and with game install sizes getting larger, buying the largest SSD you can afford is becoming increasingly important. The MX500 is one of the top performing SATA drives, and perhaps more important, it's one of the more affordable SSDs. It ends up delivering an incredible value, and the only way to get meaningfully faster results is to move to an NVM drive. To move to an NVM drive, 4. Samsung 1 terabyte. Do you want a fast SATA drive with the highest endurance around? If so, look no further than Samsung's 860 Pro line. It doesn't win every benchmark, mostly because of margin of error and the higher capacity 2TB and 4TB drives, but you can pound the drive with writes all day long without killing it. The 5-year, 1200TB warranty translates to more than 650GB written per day, every day, for 5 years. I'm not even sure what you'd be doing that would require that many writes per day, probably a server workload rather than anything you'd see on a desktop PC. On a desktop PC, 5. Samsung Evo Plus The 970 Evo Plus is Samsung's first implementation of 96-layer VNAND, which means a significant bump in transfer speeds that's purely driven by the hardware itself, and not software tinkering. It's also available at some very reasonable prices, with the 500GB model featured here regularly available around, or even below, the $100 mark. While under heavy sequential loads the transfer speeds do tend to fall off a bit, for gaming, which largely relies on random I.O., it's an absolute killer, and one of the best NVM drives we've tested, NVM drives we've tested.